and the subject of this brief video is ab reactions in hypnosis. An ab reaction is simply an unexpected and usually inappropriate response during the hypnotic process. A person may start fidgeting and when told to relax may fidget even more. The person may burst out laughing the person may burst into tears. I had been doing hypnosis for more than 20 years before I encountered my first ab reaction. I had done hypnosis in high school, in college, and in much of my professional career. And I didn't encounter an ab reaction until I was working with a woman who was told to go back into her childhood and find a pleasant experience. She was remembering a time with her mother and she burst into tears. Her question was, I don't understand. I always thought I loved my mother. Now it's easy to get distracted by uh, an ab reaction and to get focused on content rather than on process. An ab reaction is a response to something internal rather than something external. Most hypnotists have been taught to deal with external disruptions, the ringing of a phone or a doorbell, a conversation in the room that grows unexpectedly loud. Whatever the external disruption, most hypnotists have been taught to say something to the effect of, and the ringing of the phone will allow you to go more deeply and to a comfortable trance-like state. Or, the conversation in the room will grow fainter and fainter as you listen to the sound of my voice and fall even more deeply asleep. Now an ab reaction is really no different from some kind of external disruption. It can be used to facilitate the process rather than be seen as a problem. So if a person experiences an ab reaction, Take the ab reaction into account and say something to the effect of, isn't it wonderful to know that you can experience these feelings for the last time? Isn't it wonderful to know that you're experiencing these feelings now proves how fully alive and sensitive you are to everything that has influenced you and you can be as joyful as you can be sad. Now is the time to move from sadness into joy. Or you could say something to the effect of, you seem to be experiencing unpleasant feelings. And the more you experience these unpleasant feelings, the sillier they will seem. And as they become sillier, you'll find yourself moving from whatever the unpleasant feelings were into something much more joyful and pleasant knowing that all of life is filtered through your own perceptual system and you get to choose what you perceive. The main thing to remember is that ab reactions are a resource rather than a problem. So begin to think of them in ways that you can use them to facilitate the process and to help your client achieve his or her ends. You'll be glad you did. And this is Joel Bowman for SCS Matters, LLC.